Now return to Let's Play Conan Exiles. Alright. No, stop that. Stop that. Put it away. <laughs> Try me. Okay. A um, couple things. First of all, I've got a journey step here. Uh, equip an epic armor set. Now, I put all of these things on this guy. Uh, all the Lemurian stuff that we collected, but because it's got purple, I think it counts as epic. So give me a moment here. No, I just gotta put on the one. Excellent. I had that available the whole time. And I gotta start killing stuff here, because uh, my armor is starting to, to disappear. So, we are going to, first of all, eat. Um, let's go put the eyeballs of set in there. Got two of them now. Don't need the fangs. I got a bunch of stuff. Let's uh, eat. Yes, eat. There. That's what I was looking for. Okay. So, I've got a fifth slot, and we're not going to bring the horse. Um, so I may as well bring a companion, who is not at all leveled up, but can at least fight. Making sure all five are following me here. Yes. Alright. So let's head to Northwest Wall. Hopefully we've all made it. I don't know that the dog did. I've got five. Or was it? No, so the mod defaults to five, and then this extra one that I gave up. Or no? I guess I can do this. Just use the whole thing that I did this for a reason. Uh, west, sent, east, east, west sentinels. Nope. <laughs> Wrong one. East sentinels. I thought uh, east sentinels was going to send me to the other base. So it must be five inclusive. Northwest uh, wall. Yeah. The only thing with doing this this way, though, is that now I've got to wait until my corruption wears off. But we can go to Clail Stronghold from here. We don't have to travel. So while we're waiting. I'm going to put my stuff away, and I will come back. Alright, we're ready. I believe this is the one that takes me there. And here we are. close to the end of that. Double jump is pretty nice, actually, for getting around. 
It allows you to skip over some gaps and whatnot. So the second move is the big, yeah, big shield bash. I like that. Sometimes the enemies don't last long enough to get to the fourth. All right, I've only been in here once. And then I mostly went over to the Sipta map, so. Why am I alone in here? This looks like it's going to be a dark place. Hidden treasure chest behind the stairs that are full of nothing. Yeah. It's like... Uh, that, that's pretty much just the whole game. The treasure is in finding the secret, I guess. I'd be on the lookout for lore, because I have no doubt there are lore pieces in here. Shitty <gasps> treasure chest, though. That counts as a world boss, I guess. Get over here. Uh, legendary armor patch kit. Okay, I'll take that. Yeah, I thought I saw something. Where are the traps? I am Shiva of Koth. Now give ear and learn wisdom. Know that in these halls and these walls are traps to crush, burn, and flay a man's soul. Stop carefully through these halls, lest you trigger the mechanism mechanical wrath of the makers. It was intimated to me by an acquaintance among the relic hunters that this brooding keep holds a great treasure and a curse. Men whisper of the war maker and his guardians, but I am the greatest thief these lands have ever seen, so I tell you, whoever you are, if you find my bones moldering in these halls, beware, for if such as I have been slain, such as you will quickly wish yourself back in the hearth of your home. Here are the hidden chambers. I gotta wonder about those traps. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna trigger every single one of them. 
Those look like traps, for example. Trap, get off. You don't have the item that fits in this socket. Okay. Oh. Nothing to learn on that, okay. Okay, yeah, so uh if I if I do recall, we have to beat bosses in each of these chambers to give me the items. Skulls. You can always use those. If I'm not mistaken, if I don't hurry, the things respawn around here too. I have to fight our way out. That is a giant king. off against the demon, but that ain't gonna happen, apparently. We found Nortis and the statue of the War Maker. Okay. Um, do you provide... Broke into the War Maker's bedroom. So I'm not really sure. It seems like there's a lot more giant kings around than just the three. And uh, they claim to be, like, the last of the race. So I'm not really sure who. Like, is this actually Clail? Or was this just a, a warrior of his, like a general of his? We have one of the statues anyway. So I think the trick then is that I gotta put the statues in the right thing. And if I don't, I trigger a trap. Kinda cool skulls though. They don't Yeah, they're not something I can interact with to get it any kind of uh, story.
This looks like the archivists. something. A relic fragment. And a sorcerer's scroll. Okay. Now that's not super useful. Take the seeds. So what is the relic fragment? Dictionary of Zimri. Okay. I have no idea where the Zimri is. I imagine it is an ancient, like pre uh, Hyborian age civilization. Perhaps. for me to... I will take the star metal ore. A lot of creepy noises around here and I don't see anything in here. Also, like, awful. Just sand in the bed all the time. Miserable. If I... I think it's that door opens. Like this is just the first part. Uh, Bloodstained Red Nails. Consume, plus 60 health. A manuscript written by the archivist himself. The book describes the life and work conditions of a barbarian who suffers from fear of blood. Most of the book is dedicated to the barbarian trying to clean his nails. The story feels wrong, but it is strangely inspiring when read. If written by another author, it could have been a very good read. I think this is referencing... What's the story called? Blood Red Nails? Pretty sure it's a Conan story. Oh, 
Also, why am I taking damage? That should be being divvied up now. So next is the Priest King, and here's an altar to set. said attack. Attack the man in the back. Justice, Mitra's justice, really. What's the story behind that one? Why would a set worshipper have this? Interesting. A mace from collection of the priest king. Yeah. So, but like, I, I, I don't know. I don't know if we're fighting shades of them. If we're fighting, like, if, and entering in here, we've we've warped time. If they're generals of the priest kings, like the the remainder, I have no idea. I think it was just an excuse to put them in the game, honestly. These locations appear over a map. I do not know what I found here. This architecture is not familiar to me yet. It speaks to me, entices me. It wants me to explore it further. I've heard voices in a foreign tongue coming from the other doors, and I have no interest in finding out whom they belong to. This door interests me, though. It is blocked by some sort of mechanism. It may have something to do with these statuettes, this statuettes that I have found. Well, they were lying around the place, so I picked them up. I'll try my luck with opening the door. They don't call me Bjorn the Lucky for nothing. Um, I think these may have to do with certain locations that we find them, perhaps not. Why don't you come over here? Stop oh. following me, just in case we trigger a trap. Statuette of the Archivist. So there's one in the city, right? That you fits, okay. Then we found the one up here. Guess not. Okay. And this one? <laughs> does appear to be that one. Uh, wrong. Is that enough? I guess so. Okay. So it's just the three locations around the place. And not, uh, not hidden. Oh no. Trap. 
trap that uh, should have been very obvious to me. Aside from, you know, whole body just lying there. Problem is, these jackasses might trigger them. So, yeah, there's multiple ways. And if I'm not mistaken, we can go through here and bypass a lot of it. Provided we miss the traps. Can I climb? I cannot. Okay, I am mistaken then. I think this might be the way out. I think it circles around. Skeleton is floating now, cool. It's poison? Or just bad textures? I did have an issue with the game telling me I had corrupted files when I started and I had to do the file integrity check. Like bad textures. Bad textures that kind of give away where the traps are. That's interesting. Fuck. Yeah, something's wrong here, for sure. Oh, Jesus. Dye for once there's some dye with some color. Yeah, well, crap. <laughs> this is gonna be. It's gonna be unpleasant. Oh, well, I will jump this and you guys can trigger the trap. Jesus. Uh huh. I guess that's how you get up there then, huh? Obviously, there's some stuff down there, but I think we want to finish this and I want to look in here. Rusted key. Uh, what do those go to? Opens the lock somewhere, unless the rust gets to it first. Oh, fuck. So it's time. That's okay. We've got two hours to find it by the look of it. Level 100. I wonder if can I, my companions don't trigger traps. damage mitigation, um, I'm going to be okay if I step on anything.
Hopefully I find something useful for all this stuff. a door, obviously. Let's see where this leads first. Death. Now would be a really great time to have that double jump. That didn't go too well for me. It's a lot of damage all at once. Big one. Get me the fuck out of here. Arena. to the arena, so there is, as I recall, there is a way to get through and skip part of the map, and it is like through the, oh, this is a dead end. I, I, I can't jump for shit right now, what the hell? It's not like I'm encumbered. I guess my armor is not, not the best. Bumping up agility, bumping up agility should increase my mobility, though, while in armor. At least that's how it used to work. I don't know. Not about things now. Fuck. What the fuck. It just in case I have the opportunity to fix it. I'm sure I could get some bones off all this stuff. I've got plenty of bones. What I need, though, is the blue goo. So we got. Very little bit of time here. Okay, let's not go that way if we can help it. Okay, 
so this was just a dead end. Now we gotta go through this shit. Hey. Ah. Is this what I'm thinking of, maybe? Maybe not. If you crouch, you can bypass that area. I'm pretty sure that's what the arena thing is about. But seeing as how you got you got the guy right there. I don't see well no, I guess we had to go oh my fucking god. Now is not the time. Since you had to go down the other path to get the key, I guess that makes sense. But I think there's a, a like a champion in here anyway. Taking some damage. What the hell was that? Oh. Late comers to the party, apparently. They're taking some damage, and that is because we're in food. What's that? Armor scraps. Right. We use that. We use that to make stuff in here somewhere. Is a, that is a big problem. That is a really big problem. Um. They're not going to last very long. If uh... <laughs> so, so that's what's keeping them immortal. It's having the food, um, but with the damage share, it's actually killing them, like terribly. Learn to exile epics. You need to learn exile epics to use this. Which comes from there. Unlock. Unlock. I think I think that's fine for there. Arena champions armor. Fantastic. Alright, you know what we're going to do here? Cheating, but whatever. Um, I didn't realize how much food they they went through. That's ridiculous. Uh, roasted haunch. Give me a bunch of that. Just fill you all up, because I would like to make it through here. So, once again, 
foiled by the fact that I didn't bring along a ton of food. I'll just leave the rest in my bag just in case. They were taking a lot more damage than I had initially anticipated um, if they went through it that fast. Cause they probably should have still had... I guess I didn't check, but they probably should have had quite a bit uh, after after the Dagon dungeon. So how much did you go through in that fight? <laughs> None. I, don't know, I guess we'll see. Maybe it's the scrap that's used for that. Uh, let's look at armor. Let's look at... What do you think it is? I guess we can look. Arena. Arena armor. Arena champion. Vonier's design. So 350 for that breastplate? That's pretty decent, actually. But I think it's it's the stuff that we learn off the end boss of the dungeon that we use the scraps for. But it, uh, it's not like the giant forge. We don't make it here. I think once it's unlocked, I can make it back in my place. But it requires scrap, which makes me wonder if I should have been killing and uh, removing stuff from everybody. I'm breaking them down, seeing what they drop. Oh. Are we heading into a cold? Do I need chili? Kind of looks like it. I know there's going to be spiders and stuff. Along the way. Perhaps along here, though. There's some spiders. There's the spiders. Okay, undead stuff. But in that case, I still happen to have some of the undead potion which I can't use... Oh, because i got to put it on my weapon, right? Got to drag and drop it. Um, if I'm not mistaken, there is a mammoth at some point. There's a chamber um, of mammoths. Interesting. Oh, jeez. Oh boy, there's a dragon in there. You're not fighting it. Where's the other one? I'm missing somebody. Are you guys fighting it? Did you hurry up and kill this thing? If we hurry, I can get in there and maybe scout the place out before... I know who drops the key.
not one of my, uh, no, nope, my rusted keys are not part of that. For real? Right. <laughs> uh, I never did get another bow. I'm doing damage to it, like a lot of damage. Like a lot of damage, how is that possible? What the hell? Interesting how many I can summon, though. Jesus, you gotta be shitting me. Alright. Oh. Skeleton key. Do I even have to... Comfort now. For the Black Dragon Pike, a weapon I've already got. Oh, that's either a wampa or a mammoth. <laughs> I am surprised, actually. I, I know I said it, but there's a mammoth. I am surprised how much damage those arrows did. Obviously, that is not a strong dragon. There are two of them. Okay. Fucking time. So they must only come on criticals then? Because there should be at least one by now. Like, I haven't even triggered the fight ability to give my people a buff. Okay, he's dead! 
a reason to come in here. <sighs> yeah? <laughs> I mean, I guess. Steel. Grey Lotus Potion. You know, I could probably eat one of those. Drink one of those, whatever. God, we're already approaching an hour. Dungeon's longer than I thought. snowman trapped in there. I don't think you can actually open that. I think it's just there to show it off. I don't think that the light helps. <laughs> well, maybe it does. Yeah, yeah. It's alive in there, too. Pretty sure you can't open that, though. It's just there. Oh. Here it is. Final boss. Y'all ready? I mean, how's your food? Good. You've been doing really well. Oh, we do not need this many bones. Um, I got the heads. I don't need that. Let's go! Traps in here. Damn it. So there are, there are chambers around to the side, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, like this one. I guess I can explore that after killing him, though. he'll let me walk around. In which case, why not? Yeah. In fact, I might just be able to walk out of here without even fighting him. I don't think so. I don't think that will trigger... Tell you. Is this the one I came in? If I remember correctly, this guy has some really annoying AoE attacks. Rusted key. Ah, there we go. That's what they're for. I do believe we get some really good armor off this guy. It's odd. Symmetry of the room was a little bit broken there. Can I just not take that? So there's treasure, but it's not, you know, it's quote unquote treasure. It's not uh, anything super special. One, two. There's the door we came in. There's three. Godbreaker armor. So I could just pop in here, learn it, or make her weapons, and then not, not even bother. are all doing the half A pose. I've never seen that. I've seen T poses. I've seen A poses. I've never seen a half A pose in games before. It's kind of weird. Is that a... 
Is that a bomb? I may regret this. Oh. Thought maybe it was gonna be an explosion and it would like crack that open or something. Alright, well. Mindful of the traps, people. Oh, right. He gets bigger. He goes through iterations and gets bigger. This is actually the first time I've played the game with any uh, significant amount of thralls. Putrid meat. Tons. Oh my god, my inventory's gonna be so full. That's, that's not what I want. Alright, so that's it. Um, but now we gotta get out. This is the one. This is the one with the stones. Okay. Now we can get out. Yeah. And now the familiar passage. I do think we have to backtrack. My people are not coming with me. So this is the area that we couldn't climb before. <laughs> As you guys just <gasps> run off the edge. And everything's back. So we gotta fight our way back out. So from a game design perspective, you know, that's a pretty clever thing with the traps. Um, putting a body there, like bait, <laughs> you know? It's, uh, I guess I guess you could say it's good game design. Does it then alert you to, hey, this place now has traps in it? I wish, however, we didn't have to fight our way back out. It's kind of a pain in the ass. Seriously, put a, a boss that's almost as strong, if not just a little bit stronger, health-wise anyway, as the final boss. Right at the door. 
and then you gotta fight your way back out of it. I mean, you don't have to. We could probably run up the stairs and get out of here. Alright, take the repair kit. Jesus Christ. Can we just run? Maybe I can just run. stronghold. So, I guess perhaps I am uh, a little bit overly cautious in my worry about how difficult these things are going to be. We could probably go through the one underneath the city now. Uh, delete. There. Um, yeah. So, I'll make my way back to base, and uh, I guess we can go do that dungeon next time. I can't really think of anything else to do. Try and make some of the new armor, perhaps. And, uh, yeah, whatever. Okay, well, I'll see you then.